Hello my lovely crafters, this is Crafty Sue 519 welcome to my channel. And today is my Saturday mishmash. Guess what? I made some cards, yay! I got something to show you that I finally made. I dedicated yesterday to card making day. I said I have to put aside a day, get away from the crocheting and just go make cards. I missed making them. So I set yesterday aside and of course, my son came over with my grandsons to tell me all about their cruise. And they were here for like three hours. So by the time they left, it was mid-afternoon. And, but it was wonderful hearing all of their stories and looking at the pictures and, and everything. Apparently the boys were not thrilled with the trip. They were bored. How can you be bored when you're in Rome and Greece and Turkey and Naples and oh my gosh. Anyhow, I gave them the good old grandmother speech about how they should appreciate what their parents did for them. <laughs> uh, 13 years old. All they care about is iPads and games. Anyhow, it was a really, really nice visit. I had a great time with them and i um, so happy that they had the opportunity to do this. So, what do I have for you today? I have a new paper pumpkin kit. We will open that together. And I have the cards that I made. And we'll see those as well. So let's get started with the paper pumpkin kit. Just got this in the mail. Here we go, and the name of it is Fun in the Sun. So I'm guessing it's summer, summertime stuff. Haven't looked at it yet. All I did was take the wrapper off the outside. Good thing I did because it took me a little bit to do it. Okay, I can't see it. Cannot see it. Let me get a piece of paper here. Well, this is weird. Here we go. Oh, it's because everything is in weird. Looks like we got a little sunshine, a starfish, and a bunch of sentiments. Hello, sunshine. They're all in different directions. Hello, sunshine. Waving hello, I-C-S-E-A, brighter days ahead. Sending an ocean of love. Ah, I'm beginning to get what this is now. Wish you were here. Relax, you deserve it. And sending sunshine to. Okay. So that's the stamp set that came with it. Oh, yeah, 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 I got an ink spot. And this is Daffodil Delight. That must be for the sun. <laughs> ah, it's fun opening these. I have no idea what they sent you or what they want you to make. Okay. It's all, like, all packaged up. They do package these quite nicely, don't they? We'll put the box away and see what we have in here. Ah, see, summertime. It's pretty with the beach and umbrella and surfboards. And it's home, right? I live in Florida. <laughs> It's home. Okay, let's get this plastic off of here and see what they have for us to play with. Okay, so we have some double-sided tape. I guess these are little gems. 
clear gems. Yeah, they're not, they're not um, dots. So let's see, we've got envelopes. Oh, I think I'm gonna like this. One, two, three, four, five. Five of these. And one, four of these. Oh no, They're, are they all the same? They're all the same. Ah. See, I didn't look at this first. It's that one side of the envelope is like that, then the in, inside is the blue. Cute, 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 cute. And then we have these. And these are um, pop-outs that you can get used to put on your cards. Very cute. And you get, looks like two of those. Nope, three. They're confusing me here. And then you get this one. And with that, looks like it's sunset here. You get this big one. Not seeing the cards. Where did I find that? There we go. Oh, I see. It's a funny shape here. Those will be cute cards. I like it. I don't do summer stuff very often. Almost never. So you know what? This is going to be fun. It's the sand on the bottom. So you've got your beach. I had bought a kit. Uh, uh, I used to have a subscription to Hero Watts years ago. And I got one and one of the month's kits was a summertime one and I have all the beach and the beach chair and and um, I even got embossing powder that looks and feels like sand. Very cool. Very, very cool. And I did make several cards with that back then. See, so here's the, that one that has the different shape at the top. Cool. And you got three of these. I don't know what this makes. What does this make? I don't know. Have to play, have to play. And then we've got another one. My goodness. Oh, we've got lots of different things here. Got this, this is like these, except the tan color. My goodness, got a lot. And then we have these pop out things. Oh, look at the palm trees. I love that. And a little sign. Oh, I love that. Cute. Cute. I have a dead palm tree in my backyard. I have no idea how palm trees die. But it went to palm tree heaven. Now I have to hire somebody to come and cut it down before it falls over if we have a hurricane and damages everything. But it's gone. It's gone. I know nothing about palm trees. I'm a New England girl. Look at all the stuff to make cards. I can't believe this. More sand. The surfboards and the umbrella. This is so cute. I am impressed. Impressed. Oh, look at these. You got crabs and flip-flops and scallop shells, and starfish, sunglasses. Oh my gosh. This is so cute. And we have banners to be to put sentiments on i hope i'm i'm showing this well i'm so busy looking at it myself oops these are falling out but i had a strip with three of these beach chairs how cute are those ah. here we go and some glue dots glue dots 
The end. The end. Well, that's nice chipboard. Save that. Save that. Wow, that's quite a kit, isn't it? I, I really enjoy this. I was not too, too enthusiastic when I saw the name of it. Fun in the sun or whatever it was. Summer fun. Fun in the sun. Nope, nope. But I think it's so cute. I think it's so cute. Wow, there's a lot in here this time. Can't wait to see what everybody's alternatives are this year. Well, this month, I should say. When everybody goes rogue and doesn't follow the instructions and does their own thing. It's fun. It's fun. Just put it back in here so I don't lose anything. Even the envelopes are fun. Fun, fun, fun. Fun in the sun. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Crazy. I have to tell you, my... My... Yawn Warriors are just out of this world. Out of this world. Oh my gosh, I got a box of yarn yesterday. You would not believe how big it is. Oh, unbelievable. But I'm not showing that on Saturday Mishmash because I have Welcome to Plushy Wednesday for that. But they have been incredible. Absolutely incredible. I start a new project today. I can't wait to do it, but we will see. Now, if you've been following me for a while, you know I like to do the sheet load of cards that Call Me Crafty Al does every month. And in it, she just gives you, let me show it to you. I just put it away too, I shouldn't have done that. You can print these up or save them on your computer, but I like to have the paper in front of me. And she just gives you a sketch of how to put this card together. And then you make up your own designs and everything. Um, she tells you everything you need, how to cut out every piece of paper. Um, and then she always has a video the day after she releases this, which is always on the first of the month, the day after, she shows you how to put it all together. Well, it's, just look at the picture and it's pretty self-explanatory. The only thing I did different with this is I made, she has the top fold card, I made a side fold. And, but it still works out to the same thing. I did not put this strip here. I did cut them all out, but then what I decided to do as the focal point, I didn't have room for a strip. So, um, you, you, you know, make what you want, adjust it how you like, but it's great having an idea on how you can put the cards together. And this made 12 cards, 12, I made 12 cards yesterday. So it was very, very easy because you only had to use two 12 by 12 pieces of paper of the um, pattern paper. So you didn't switch it around all that much. There was only two ways you could do it to have everything come out right. But this is the first one. Look how cute this is. And I went back and used my peach stamp set from Stamping Up. And I stamped this little peach on here and I cut out this little butterfly because I didn't like this open space down here. And I don't want it two dimensional to mail it because post office is crazy these days. And put my thing on the back and on the inside, I just put happy birthday and some little flowers in the bottom as a decoration. And that's it, that's it. And all this is is three strips of paper on your cardstock and it's so cute. And then you do what you want. You can do a piece of ephemera, you can do a sticker, you can do whatever you want to decorate the center of it. And it's so easy. And I think this came out so cute. And now I have 12 birthday cards, which is awesome. So the opposite of this one is this one. Same thing, everything's the same. 
except the papers just swapped. So where this and this was green and this was the pattern paper, I just switched them and made six like this. Insides are the same. Insides are the same. But look at that, 12 cards. Once you get, it's like a assembly line process. Once you get everything all cut out, and in this case, I did a lot of stamping because that's what I chose to do. Um, you don't have to do that, but I don't know why this stamp set popped in, into my head, but it did, and I said, let's go with it, and I think they came out pretty cute. So let me know what you think. And August birthdays, this is what you're getting. I'm gonna have more left over, which is good because I demolished my stash of birthday cards for July because I never got in here to make birthday cards for July. So I always try to keep some extras on hand for that reason, because my plushies are keeping me busy. So these are my cards that I made. Felt so good to be back in here and play with paper again. And um, that's about it. I haven't had a lot of time to watch a lot of videos. I try, I have watched some. Sometimes I comment, sometimes I don't. It's all time, time. Um, now that Grumpy is better, I hope to be able to get in here at least one day a week, to, maybe two to make something, but it all depends on how many orders I have for plushies because that will come first. I don't want people having to wait because I wanna make cards or whatever. So anyhow, I hope you understand that, but I think that's it. I think that's it. Oh, guess what Grumpy's doing right now? Of course, because he can drive again, he's out shopping because he loves to shop. I do not. I like to online shop. I don't like to go to the stores. He's going to Dollar Tree to look for yarn for me. <laughs> I think he's jealous that I call the, uh, let me see, I've gotten four packages of yarn so far, and I know of at least one more that's coming. Um, and I call them my yarn warriors because they've been helping me out with that. And uh, I think he wants to be a yarn warrior. <laughs> so he's out looking for yarn. All righty, everybody. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful weekend. Stay cool. It's been hot, real hot. So stay cool. And remember, be creative. Have fun. Do something just a little bit naughty. Love yous. Bye.